that we work. Now, here's after sin, okay? And this is where some of us um, start our theology of work, and that's a problem. If you don't start at God being one that engaged in work and was productive, if you don't start with God has given us dominion and, and instructs us and commands us to be productive, have dominion and rule the earth well. If you start after sin, where, so here's what happened after sin. So as God is giving the consequences for um, disobedience, in chapter 3, verse 16, the Bible says, And to the woman, he said, I will surely multiply your pain in childbearing. In pain you shall bring forth children. Your desire shall be contrary to your husband, but he shall rule over you. And to Adam, he said, Because you listened to the voice of your wife and have eaten of the tree, which I command you, you shall not eat. Cursed is the ground because of you. In pain you shall eat of it all the days of your life. Thorns and thistles it shall bring forth for you, and you shall eat the plants of the field. By the sweat of your face you shall eat bread till you return to the ground, for out of it you were taken, for you are dust, and to the dust you shall return. The man called his wife's name Eve because she was the mother of all living. Whoa! So we have a society that um, perhaps is trying to escape work and maybe seeing work as a curse of God. But like we mentioned earlier, God's example of work doesn't start at the curse. In fact, what we see in chapter three is how um, work became harder right? God always intended for us to work, but the work at the beginning was, hey, be fruitful and multiply. Now that same work of being fruitful and multiply now is associated with pain and childbearing. That same work of being a helper, you know, being a helpmeet, that has become harder because now her desire will be contrary to her husband to rule over. Adam, you are to subdue the earth and tend the ground and keep it. Now it becomes harder because um, thorns and thistles are going to grow. So if anything, we should see this current um, um, dynamic of work is a result of disobedience to God. And now this becomes harder. The command to work didn't change. It's just that sin had added greater resistance to accomplishing the work God has commanded. Does that make sense? So before the fall, be fruitful and multiply. Hey, the woman is your helpmeet. Hey, tend the earth, um, subdue it, have dominion, keep the earth and tend it. <coughs> After the fall, you know, you multiply, but it's going to be painful, right? Um, you're going to be, there's going to be strife uh, instead of simply a helping relationship, right? There's going to be thorns and thistles on the sweat of your brow. Now 